Hi, I'm Peter Bobbin from the tax team at uh, national law firm Rock Olivia. Here we're just going to briefly chat about tax debts. Did you know they're potentially negotiable? Gaining a tax debt may can be may be a surprise to many people, particularly if they thought their tax affairs were perfectly planned as to the past, or perhaps they weren't so perfectly planned and someone got found out. Tax debts can, if the result is it would otherwise make a person bankrupt, be actually negotiable. The tax office does have authority to compromise a tax debt. What's important is that you act quickly. It is really important. What so many people unfortunately do is they put their head in, their sand, in the sand and they seek to forget about it or wish it that would go away. I can tell you it certainly won't. Whether we're talking large corporate, small trust or an individual, tax debts can, if it would otherwise have the result of an insolvency event or a bankruptcy, they can in fact be negotiated. How do you do that? Well, you make direct and very quick contact with the debt recovery people of the tax office. Talk to them about what it is you can pay, talk to them about what it is that you can't pay, and quite simply seek to negotiate a terms payment arrangement. I can say that I've done that successfully on quite a number of occasions for the benefit of clients. And really, it's a benefit all round. The tax office really is not out there to bankrupt people. That's not its intention. Its obligation is to collect proper tax. And if the circumstances are appropriate for negotiating a tax debt, they actually will. But doing nothing about it makes things worse. Trying to achieve a compromise at the very last death door, so to speak, just before bankruptcy is filed or bankruptcy application is filed, really doesn't cut it. Act early, move quickly, make some decisions, be open and discuss it. That's my recommendation. Thank you.